Hey guys, I just wanted to make a video predicting who the next flavor of the month for in the uh, Republican presidential field will be, and that will be uh, Newt Gingrich. And you're probably thinking, Newt Gingrich, you know, that guy has no chance of winning. Well, you know, I've been observing some of the uh, uh, conservative circles. You know, you just go onto some of the internet forums, you go to Facebook pages, and all of the regular mainstream conservatives you know, the Fox News types, um, you know, they're either chanting for Herman Cain or Newt Gingrich. And so I think Newt Gingrich, you're going to see in the next couple of months, he's going to rise in popularity in the polls. Uh, he's going to be taken more seriously in the upcoming debates, and he's going to be competitive in the primary process. And, um, you know, I could not have made this prediction a couple of months back if somebody asked me if he was going to be competitive, I would have said no, you know, he has no chance of winning anything. But since I've been listening to other people, listening to other conservatives who've watched the debate, you know, we're not talking about Ron Paul type conservatives, that's who I am, but most of them are not. Uh, they're just like, well, you know, I like what Ron Paul has to say, but dot dot dot, you know, you know the whole story on that. Uh, but a lot of them say, gee, that Newt Gingrich guy is so smart. So, you know, look out, he's the next one that's going to be coming out. Um, because I think a lot of conservatives are getting a little tired with Herman Cain in the past couple of weeks that he's come out. And, uh, you know, uh, he's been the flavor of the month. You know, last month it was Rick Perry. In August it was Bachman. So they change very rapidly because the, the conservative base who are stuck on social issues and domestic issues, and that's fine, you know, some in economics, you know, they may have right, they may have it right on economics, but uh, they're completely ignorant when it comes to the Federal Reserve and foreign policy, um, and they're kind of stuck on social issues all the time, but they do have it right when it comes to economics. Most of them, uh, they're just constantly searching for some perfect candidate. Of course, I'm already set on Ron Paul. And the moderates and the rhinos are already set on Mitt Romney. So it'll be Mitt Romney versus Ron Paul versus who else? And I think it will be Newt Gingrich. And if not Newt Gingrich, if my prediction isn't right, then it will be Herman Cain. And that's who the top three people will be during the primary process that takes place in January of next year. So I just want to make that prediction. Think about it and give me your feedback. Thanks.